this is a short video to fix some issues introduced in the previous two videos, 8 and 9. First was the use of an interface class and the second concerns issues with the behaviour tree. I only realised this after uploading the videos and since YouTube doesn't allow you to replace a video only to do a redirect I felt it was necessary to make this short video instead. First let's deal with the combat interface. In retrospect this is a big mistake. I never did see why Ryan Ailey introduced this. It just massively overcomplicated things in C++. Um, it's more a sort of a blueprint thing. It's not the way I would do things in C++ with interfaces anyway. So um, I've exited Unreal Engine although I do have the project load screen open ready to reload the project because we're going to delete something and what we're going to delete are these two files combatinterface.cpp and combatinterface.h just going to remove now Visual Studio doesn't actually delete the files from disk so I'm going to do that with a PowerShell so I go to tools uh, command line develop a PowerShell and that should put me in the right directory. Yeah, it's put me in the root directory now. If I look at the contents of this directory, I think we need to delete the binaries folder. Um, because otherwise Unreal has a tendency to think that things still exist. So uh, answer A to that to get rid of that. So that should have gone. Now we go to um, its source backslash cpp ai and this is where all your c++ files are so i'm just gonna uh, delete uh, what was it combat interface dot style do it so that should have gone yeah now I've got to start altering stuff. So the MPC was the first to reference this. Let's get rid of this uh, header include for combat interface.h. Get rid of this, the pub inheritance for it. And now all this stuff down here, this, um, yeah, I'm going to delete that. in so void melee attack I would like to make this constant but I found you can't I need to implement this guy and put the code in which is just uh, if to alter that behaviour tree task, the melee attack. I think it's just a CPP that which needs altering. It's got a reference to the combat interface in there, just get rid of that. I'm going to copy this into the if statement like this, put it in the condition. And um, we just want to change this to MPC and get rid of this execute melee attack it's called melee attack thus everything else is fine I believe um, should be able to do a build which we need to do before I can load the project into Unreal anyway so um, so what happens if we get a successful build right successful build so now we can load this in Unreal. So here we are back in Unreal. Um, let's have a look at that folder. 
yeah it's got the combat interface is gone so I can open up the behaviour tree this is the second issue uh, this is all wrong um, I've put the um, decorator on the wrong place that should be on the um, melee attack and these are all in the wrong order and everything and we need to use a <coughs> simple parallel node um, so let's move this onto here uh, let's make it whoops don't want to do that let's make it a lower priority I need to drag off of here and put in a simple parallel now this has two sort of lanes or channels the blue the purple one is the main task which we're going to make chase player let's disconnect it first <clears throat> here is that it's going to the default for this is immediate finish mode so uh, if this finishes which it will it won't execute the media attack it will immediately come out so I want to change this to delayed and it says when main task finishes wait for background tree to finish so it will wait for this to uh, execute and finish so um, oh yes the other thing we need to do this is plowing range I set that at 25 that's way too low but I found by a lot of experimentation that the minimum is, minimum is 77 but I'm going to set it to actually to 300 so we can see that it's actually punching as it's running um, I don't believe we need anything else um, just make sure these are set to the right. Ah, um, that I don't think it need. Yeah, we're not using um, um, key selectors. We're doing it in C plus um, plus. But I'll change that to that. I don't think it matters. I'll set the speed to six hundred. It was five hundred. I think that's it. So if I give it a play, it should actually work. So he's walking from. Waste, uh, waypoint to waypoint and now he's going to yes it's working it does seem to run and punch at the same time whoops it's a little bit difficult to see for short range attacks that it's you know really is running and ah, get away so that's all the bugs fixed I think um, as promised, in the next video we're going to be doing hearing perception. Hope to see you then.